Howdy, everybody. Phil back. We're going to do some videos. Been off this week, but I've been dealing with some AC unit, AC in my house. Had to get stuff redone, so that's been fun. I'm trying to do some videos now through the weekend. Take a look at this guy real quick. It's an IH 1486, 116th scale. There's some pictures on the box of the uh, stuff that was released around this time frame. There's a classic old box cardboard fold in for the tractor to hold it. I always like these myself. That's pretty cool. When it was new, it was $38.99. Released in 2003. Hurdles and Racing Champions back then. Always nice to see that price in my box because I'm pretty sure this tractor isn't that now. All right, let's move on to the star of the show, the IH 1486. All right, everybody, I'm back. Also, my background has changed a bit. I'm uh, removing some stuff around because I had to move stuff for the AC work guys to do their stuff. So I'll be rearranging this between now and the end of the weekend. I'm going to buy another shelf for that empty spot and then another shelf for this wall on the right hand side. I'll have it fixed up soon. Here it is, the 116 scale Earl 1486. And it doesn't say on the box, but it's red power. That's pretty cool. You know, from what I understand, the red power tractors were produced between 1979 and 1980. Had this special decaling and signification of them being in that line. And I, I took it like they were kind of demo tractors in a way, but somebody else knows, let me know. That's the best I read about it. But the 86 series was produced between 76 through 81. And this particular tractor, the 1486, was 145 horsepower in the PTO, I think. Pretty awesome looking tractor here. This is straight out of the box. I've done nothing. My favorite thing is they... Space to do was really nicely, I thought. Here's your hitch, straight out of the box. Rear end, straight out of the box. Nice 86 series cab designs here. Decaling for the lights and brake lights and work lights and everything. Inside the cab, you got a red seat there. I each red, black steering wheel. It's all plastic mold in there. Let's see signature looking uh, 86 series hood there nice long black oh, uh, round muffler with a uh, rain cap on it your uh, decaling is your black stripe with the white borders white and international on that black over the engine front near the cab in the engine area Model number 1486, red power insignia right there. The ones that weren't red power, as everybody knows it, that had the white covering this panel on both sides. Engine decal, details and components. Pretty cool little IH logo on there. Pretty neat. Like I said, this tractor straight from the box. Of course, also your decals, you got the IH branding iron there. That's Signifying the red power. It's pretty cool. Decaling on the front grill is all decaled. The lights and the IH emblem in the grill. There's the bottom of the tractor. Like I said, tires are six around all rubber. Standard Earl tire, but I really love how they spaced the duels out really nicely, I thought. And the wheel on the rear is that deep dished. Wheel. I, I always love these wheels myself. They're plastic, but I always love them, actually. I think they're really cool looking. Your front wheel is a standard Earl 3 rib on many tractors. Your front tire, I should say, and then your wheel. Mm -hmm. Silver outset rim there, very outer part, and your eye tread, the rest of it. Pretty standard tractor. Released. What, 20 years ago next year, so 19 years old. It looks like they might have took, you know, past castings and just redid this and used another casting, be my guess. All right, we'll do a comparison. Let's do that now. All right, everybody, here's my 1486 shelf model, I would call it, alongside my 1486 Prestige Edition 
you can see there's some really, really standout details on this one in comparison to the other. Of course, I mean, you got a prestige line tractor there, so they're both red power. Well, that one doesn't have, that's what's nice. It has the decaling here, but it, it don't have the branding iron and doesn't have the red power. That's, I thought that was interesting. Pretty cool though. Much more details here, of course, but that can be expected. All right, I'll move on to some final thoughts and let's do that now. All right, everybody, Herbal 116 scale IH1486 Red Power Edition, released in 2003 by Herbal. It's a pretty sharp little tractor. I love the setup of the spacing of the duels. Um, they do that as a standard now, I think, but I think back then around this time, that was a pretty newer thing they were doing, so it's pretty nice to see. It's a pretty classic little release here. All right, everybody, I'll... Uh, Close out my video. I want to thank everybody who tunes in. This is Phil. Y'all have a blessed day. We'll talk again soon.